All right, Kryptonauts, welcome back. This is really cool news, not nah, breaking news. January 18th, 2022, Intel set to reveal energy efficient Bitcoin mining chip. Wow, we already knew they're doing some GPUs and they weren't going to restrict miners. This is my biggest complaint about NVIDIA. NVIDIA seems to hate Ethereum miners. They come out with this LHR crap. They limit production on certain cards. They stop production of like the 3080s that were giving us 100 plus mega hash on Ethereum. 3090s are now stopped. What is going on in NVIDIA? I am a stockholder in NVIDIA. I'm getting a little irked. I'm 25% down on that stock. It's a turd. I'm really upset. I may dump it because I don't think they know what they're doing in Santa Clara. They got to get their act together. Intel. Intel gets it. They are making an ultra low voltage Bitcoin mining chip. This is huge. They have seen the need in the market. They see there's a problem to be solved and they are addressing it. And they know they'll make billions from miners. Miners have deep pockets, NVIDIA. You got to wake up. We buy one to many of your cards. We don't just buy one and play games all day. We buy one and say, hey, we're making some revenue on crypto. Let's buy more. NVIDIA doesn't get it. They must really hate miners. I bet a miner cut off the CEO on uh, the 30, what is it, the 280 out there in Santa Clara. And he got mad and said, oh, I'll get those miners back by giving an LHR. Arr, arr. Get off my yard, miners. All right. Enough of that. Anyway, let's go through this real quick. Technology giant Intel is set to enter the Bitcoin mining business, starting with the reveal of a new Bitcoin mining Bonanza mine chip at this year's ISSCC. Ugh. You guys can read it. Uh, it's coming in February, according to a report by Tommy's Hardware. All right. For the conference itself, Intel reportedly has a presentation prepared to outline the new Bonanza mine chip which is described as an ultra low voltage, energy efficient Bitcoin mining ASIC. That's huge. That is very huge. Because as you all know, around the world, people are all worried about the power consumption, the people, the miners using up all the electricity. And there's a problem. There's a conceived perception that mining's bad, blah, blah, blah. So Intel comes out and says, oh, we can solve this problem. We're smart. Come out with a low voltage, ultra low voltage, uh, energy efficient Bitcoin mining ASIC. Huge, man, huge. They see the need. They know there's money out there. And they know people are going to buy these machines up. And I am waiting. I am going to get some cash and get ready. No more NVIDIA cards for me, baby. I'm waiting for these ASIC GPUs to come out. I mean, these um, Intel GPUs to come out and see what these ASICs have to offer. Uh, yeah, NVIDIA, you got to get on the, you got to get with the program. Man, now I gotta dump. I gotta dump my Nvidia stock. This is getting serious. We got we got some competition. We got ourselves a, a we got ourselves a rumble. All right, let's go on. In October, Intel announced that the company's upcoming graphics cards, which we mentioned, would not include restrictions on cryptocurrency mining, in response to plans by a rival Nvidia to make its own cards less desirable for Ethereum miners. Nvidia hates miners. It's I don't get it. They're missing out. I guess they don't like money. I don't know. Ideology over money. Yeah, that's always, that always ends in failure, right? So I don't know what's going on. So Intel sees that. They're going, wow, when our enemies failing, do not interrupt. Intel's just letting them go. All right, go make LHR cards. Stop making your highly productive 3080 card that was giving crypto miners over 100 mega hash on Ethereum. Oh, just go ahead and keep doing that. Meanwhile, we're going to come out ultra low voltage energy efficient chips, GPUs that miners love. We're not designing this product or building any features at this point that specifically target miners as far as actions we're taking to avoid or lock them out. It's a product that will be in the market and people will be able to buy it. From the Intel vice president. Awesome. Well, there you go, guys. It's coming. We got some competition finally. They're addressing the energy issue. Ultra low voltage energy efficient Bitcoin mining ASIC man. So they're going to have the GPUs and they're going to have these ASIC machines. I looked up some of these other ones, the bit mains, I guess all the other ones are made in Asia. And then people are buying them. They're supposed to be new. They're coming like duct taped together, uh, refurbished. They're beat up. It's like they're obviously not new. These people are just slapping these things together, shipping them out and, and charging big bucks. And then they're saying they're new. I just said, no, I'm not buying. I'm not buying. I'm not buying these crappy ones. I'm going to wait. And then now Intel comes out today and I'm going to wait for a quality company to make a quality uh, ASIC machine and then look at it 
And then maybe you can also with River Financial, if they buy these as well, you can buy them through them and they'll house them, maintain them, store them. I don't know yet. I want to go with a company. You're putting, you're putting a lot of money in. You want to go with a company you can trust. Check it out, guys. Put it on your put it on your calendar for February when I go to this ISSCCCCSS show and you will uh, learn more. Intel set to reveal energy efficient Bitcoin mining chip. Not just the Bitcoin mining ASIC machine. They are doing energy efficient low voltage. They are going for the fence, man. They're going for the home run. All right. Good job, Intel. What do you guys think? I think this is great news. I think it's positive. Companies are jumping in, big companies. And it's not just one player in town or AMD. It's Intel, AMD, and NVIDIA. And NVIDIA is going the wrong route. And I'm a little upset by that because, like I said, I'm down 25% on the NVIDIA stock. <laughs> I have to buy Intel back. I wonder what Intel is at. Hey, while we're here, let's do it. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun. You guys see that? And I think I have NVIDIA down at the bottom. Ooh. Look at that, down 10 bucks. You guys, come on. Oh, there's NVIDIA stock. Yep, yeah, oh well. I don't know about that. Let's check Intel. I don't know if, it, if the news might have affected this or not. INTC, oh, well, not much. I think the market is down in general today. Unveil Bitcoin mining chip next month. And this is a different article. And it goes through, yeah, you can read more if you want more of the specifics. Energy efficient Bitcoin mining ASIC. It's the Bonanza Mine and Ultra, so that's what they're calling it. Bonanza Mine and Ultra Low Voltage Energy Efficient Bitcoin Mining ASIC. Pretty cool, guys. I love it. I love this type of news. It's positive, and I like that the real company is getting behind and they're going to produce products that the miners want and not kind of restrict miners from uh, doing what they do best, mine. All right, guys, I'm out. Take care. Talk